friends to meet again. Uh, today uh, we are going to try a different kind of a workout where I have broken the workout into two workouts. First is a prospect type workout where this will be a bit time that is uh, you know I will give you some certain sets which has to be done in a certain specific time. So there will be five movements starting with jumping jacks you know you are aware of it jumping jack is simple jumping jack the second movement is lunges lunges normal simple lunges no jumping just simple lunges you can do it and uh, the third one is sit ups these are normal sit ups which we do it you have to get on the floor legs you have to keep it like this Just be like this and simply you can actually swing your hand to assist. I would prefer doing it like this where you have uh, pressure coming onto your core. Uh, the fourth one is normal push ups. The normal push ups. I would recommend that everybody try these push-ups because uh, this is how the work it, workout is designed. Push-ups have to be tried and then normal burpees. These are full burpees. I would recommend people to do full burpees, only five in each set. So it will be full getting on the floor, on the floor completely, then getting up and up. So these will be five movements which we have to do back to back the cutoff time is 15 minutes we have to do five sets each cutoff time means even if you are unable to do it so you have to stop at 15 minutes timer so everybody have to have your timer ready or i'll let you know when the 15 minutes are getting forward and if you are able to do it before that you can have the rest time between you so this is how the crossfit workout are designed so this will be 25 jumping jacks, 200 lunges, sorry, 20 lunges, 15 sit-ups, uh, sit 10 push-ups, and 5 burpees. That becomes one set. I'll repeat, 25 jumping jacks, 20 lunges, 15 sit-ups, 10 uh, push-ups, and 5 burpees. That makes one set. So you have to complete five sets in a, uh, in a time of 15, sec 15 minutes. That is, the cutoff is 15 minutes. Did you get it? Any questions you have? So I might not be able to respond to you during the workout because uh, the camera is not facing me, it's on the stand. So I might not be able to look at the uh, question what you put it, but I can answer post workout. There will be a second workout in the, after that, that will be a Tabata style workout. Again, uh, in that I will not be having a, a high impact uh, workout. Workout, it will be more of uh, legs and core and only one set of uh, chest. So let's start with warm up, that we can discuss after the workout gets over. Let's start with uh, warm up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Start my normal health tracker. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
can be slower. It's just that you have to complete as many sets as you can. The maximum is five. The cutoff is 15.
cases, guys. No need to rush.
Two more days. Four minutes. CrossFit workout is done. It is two time and number of sets are normally given and then you have to do the number of sets. It can be as per time, it can be minute on minute or it can be AMRAP like as many rounds as possible. So today what we did is we did first time timed workout where you were given certain set of exercises where you were supposed to do it in a separate given time. So please do share me your scores. Scores in the sense how many sets you were able to do, 
Suppose you are able to do 3.5, so you can do you can write 3 plus wherever how many number of sets you did like 25 jumping jacks and 18 or 19 lunges you were able to do. So you can write 3 point or rather plus 25 plus 18 or 15 whatever your score is. And people who are able to complete in the entire set of five exercises in suppose 12.35 minutes so please write your score 12.35 minutes complete we have a two minute rest then we'll jump on to the Tabata workout that is a 20 minute low intensity HIIT workout where I'll be doing certain movements I'll just explain you what are the movements are We'll be doing with starting with the super planks. Super plank is on the arms, and you have to stretch a back and try to make your back as parallel as possible or as straight as possible to the ground. It's like this. Then we're doing standard squats for legs, stronger legs for athletes. So this will be always a part of any workout. So you have to go as low as possible so that you can mobilize your root joints, knees and ankles. You have to go down. Try to go down as down as possible. And open up. Then we have alternate toe touch. It's Simple stretch, similar pose, super plank pose, and then alternate toe touch. So this is how it is. Then we have dynamic squats. Dynamic squats are then we have side rotation. You have two variations in this. Whatever is comfortable for you, you can try that. So you can hit on your elbows on a side plank position. Arm right, you have to go as deep as possible and then look it up. So this will be both sides. You can even try, if you want to make it slightly advanced, you can even try it on your palm. Balance it, if you are not able to balance it, keep your leg here and balance it. Depending upon your mobility, you can try any of these movements. And then we have standard mountain climber. Then the other side, we will switch the side for side rotations. Then standard push-ups. You can do any variation, whatever you want, you can do archer, you can do diamond or standard work, standard push-ups. So we'll start in next one minute. Catch your breath, not to have water, have it. We'll start, we'll jump on right away into it. www.bootcampdownload.com This workout is 20 seconds effort with 10 seconds rest. Your workout begins in 4, 3, 2, 1. Halfway there. Three, two, one. Ten seconds rest. Four, three, two, one. Half 
Four, three, two, one. 
Just check your comments. Anybody watch two squats or death by leg along with me? That will be a seven minute workout. Do let me know. I'll wait for your comments or else we'll directly jump on to some stretchings post workout stretchings i see roddy is already exhausted so let's drop the idea of doing it get out to straight away some good mobility workout so Let's start. In next two minutes, you can catch your breath, and then we directly jump onto some good stretching workouts. Let me put some good music for stretching.
Let's go to get on the floor. Start with stretching. Stretch your leg and hold. Grounded, don't bend it like this. Straight on the floor and push. Hold. Elbows on the floor. down and feel the stretch in your groin and hamstring area. Feet has to be grounded all the time. Get onto the pigeon pose. Guys, chain the leg. Stretch. And hold. Stretch a little bit more. Try to feel the stretch in your groin and hamstring areas. This will loosen up your glute muscle and give you more mobility in your glute muscles. Keep your hands down, feet grounded and push. Grounded all the time.
change your position and go down completely and relax. You can feel the stretch extremely down in your glutes. Very good guys, up. We do some hamstring stretches. So hold your toes like this. Go down and up. And up. And up. Try to make your knees straight, as straight as possible. Hold this time. Again. One, two, three, four, and five. Hold, guys. Now we are doing some groin stretch that is a must for all the runners to keep their groin stretched and well mobilized. Hold your ankles, push your knees outside with the help of elbows like this and go down and hold the position as deep as possible. Again for groin. Count 20. And hold your position. Hold your toes like this. And try touching your head to your toes. done some good amount of push-ups so we need to loosen our shoulders also you can have a bench or a chair in your house just catch hold of that put both your elbows on the chair completely stabilized and go down and hold the position this will help you in releasing your shoulder joints, leg muscles, those are called deltoids. It will enable you to have a better movement in push-ups and pull-ups. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you guys. I think uh, we are running out of time and uh, the session is coming to an end. Please do send me your photographs, tag MRR on your FB page and Insta page. Tag me along with it. Tell me your scores and send me your beautiful faces post-workout. Thank you guys. <laughs>